Yo, what's up guys? B Terry Customs is back with another video today, and today's video is gonna be a customization on these roaches right here. We're going for a Gucci look on the roaches. So let's get into the materials, everything you're going to need to do the custom, and we do have some stuff that's coming in the mail for the laces wise. So some of this video will be later in the week before I upload it. That's why the scenery change, that's what it'll be. So all the materials aren't here right now, we can cover what we do have. So the materials you're gonna need are the shoes, you're gonna need some tape, some paint brushes, a toothbrush, a towel, some extra water, some Angelus Direct Easy Cleaner, some nail polish remover or acetone, that you're gonna need some cotton balls to go along with. And to finish it off, you're gonna need some Angelus, red paint and some white paint for different various reasons. You may need more than this, but it all depends on the kind of custom you wanna do and what you're working on. The first step you're gonna do is take your Angelus Direct Easy Cleaner, your Simple Green, your dish soap, whatever you're cleaning with today, and it doesn't matter, there's a lot of different methods. I have videos on that of what you can use to clean shoes. They'll be linked in the description below. We're gonna take that, our toothbrush and our towel and go clean up these sneakers. I may just clean them up right here in my room or I may head to the bathroom sink because it might get messy. I don't know, we'll see, let's go do this. All right, so first of all, we're gonna remove the laces and then I'm gonna get into cleaning the midsole, maybe some of the sole, the swoosh and any other part on the shoe that looks like it needs a quick cleanup. We're gonna do that with our Angelus Direct Easy Cleaner toothbrush and our towel. So now what we're going to start doing is taping up some of the back region to get our red stripe on the back. So let's get right into that. Before we do anything though, we're going to deglaze these swooshes to make sure we can paint them later if we want to. We'll have that option if we want to. And this is part of prepping the shoe. But then after that, we will get back to putting the red stripe on the back right here. So now that we have this all taped up, we're gonna lay down a coat of white on this strip right here, maybe a coat or two, and then we're gonna go to laying the red down. So that's what we're gonna do in this first video. We're gonna try to do the light coats, but if it goes on a little thick, I'm not gonna worry about it. What I am gonna do is mix the white paint and the red paint to about a one-to-one -one ratio with some water, just so when I apply it to the mesh, it feels like mesh and doesn't get real hard and uncomfortable to wear and to feel and to look at. So let's get into this. Now that we have finished up most of the back in here, we're gonna get into painting some of the inner liner and this little liner right here. So let's get into it. You're gonna use a one to one ratio of red paint to water or paint medium, paint thin or something like that. So it makes the liner nice and soft like it is now and it's not hard and crunchy and it just cracks anywhere. So we're gonna make sure it bonds real nice with the one to one ratio. All it took me was a risk. Turn a dollar to a grip. Always starving at the crib. Shit, I guess it is what it is, huh? Now I stack it till it's over way. And, and you niggas didn't listen. They go say it from a distance. What? Captain Swank got bitches. Wait, wait. A million ways to make a million. Mm. Time is what y'all really killing. Yeah. Someone stop this evil villain. Uh. Captain Swank, what she feeling? Uh. Now I stack it till it's over way. Till I don't know what to do with it. Chasing. 
American dreams could be a still image. Yeah. A million ways to make a million. Now stop and just listen. Ambition, ambition, no room for mistakes. Just risking a vision of a big house with a million dollars. Bad, bad bitches that is want to baller. Nice whips with the new dog. Fits the Gucci pants just to flex the stairs. Killing diggers with a pinky rig. Diamond grill just to watch it dance. All you really want to hate. Now that we have the inner lining right here painted, we're going to get on to painting this. And there are some splatters of red already on it. That's no big deal. We're just going to hit it up with some red and then go from there. So let's get the custom going and keep it rolling throughout this dope video. Now we still have some detail work to do before the custom's over, but what we're gonna do right now is add a splattering effect to this swoosh right here. And we're gonna use our X-Acto knife and cut out the swoosh so there's tape covering all the green around it so no red gets on the green, or we can do as best as we can. And then we're gonna splatter the swoosh with a toothbrush. You guys will see that method here very soon, but let's get into it, I'm gonna cut it out. You'll see the time lapse on how to do it and I have more videos describing it. This will just be a rough description, let's go. Yeah. Okay, okay. Okay, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. North side booming shorty, yeah, that's where I rap. With my south side niggas, same niggas selling pack. And my west side shorty hit my line like where you at. And I told her, hold her horses on and I'ma hit you back and call the Uber. Now we're gonna touch up some of the green areas on the back and up in this area. We're gonna do that real quick. Then we're gonna have one last laces custom to do and the custom will be complete. Most of these bitches is hoes. Most of these niggas is broke. Most of these niggas, they lie. They just be selling that hoe. Now to complete this custom, we're gonna use some custom laces from Lace Lab. These are the 3M Reflective Laces. This is the inverse colorway. Inverse white, if you guys were wondering. And we have some bullet, aka gunmetal, silver, lace tips we're gonna put on here so let's get into this customization of the laces and then we're gonna throw the laces on tomorrow after these are nice and dry and show you guys the on feeds not the on feeds but the final pictures of this custom Thank you guys for watching this video. Here's the final product on these roaches. We got that Gucci look going on. Got the red in here. Got the red going on right here. Let me show you guys this shoe. This shoe looks real nice. The red stripe on the back for that Gucci. We got some splattering on the swoosh to give it some more Gucci effect. And then the laces from Lace Lab to top it off. These things are just crazy. These are the 3M inverse reflective white ones with the gunmetal silver aglets on them. So yeah, you guys will see some pictures at the end. But I want to thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe if you like these kind of customization tutorial videos. And I really appreciate it if you do. Links are always down below to cop all the nice stuff to do the customization work on your own and learn how to do it yourself. So, BTR Customs, I hope you like the Roches. I'm out. <laughs>